fancy ones. Since March is National Craft Month, we want to do something extra special for you, <laughs> pun intended. For so long, Easter egg dye was really the only thing we did, the only tool for decorating them. But now there are so many other options available. And Jill Krause is here to help us explore these. Hi, Jill. Thanks for Hi, being yeah. here. Thanks for having me. All right, help me branch out. What can we do beyond traditional dye? Yeah, because, you know, I don't like getting my hands dirty. And I have kids at home, and that's just... Oh, it's a disaster. It's a nightmare, yeah. right? So these are lower mess alternatives okay, to good. dye. So the first one, I'm not going to say this is like no mess, because this is decoupage, and that can be a little messy. But it's super easy to do. I'm a big hoarder of the tissue paper that comes with my kids' birthday and Christmas present. Oh, sure. So you just take a little of this Mod Podge, and you can get this at any craft store. You brush it on your egg, and then you just add your tissue paper right on there. And it's fun because you can do all different colors. You can layer it. And this is a good one to get the kids involved, especially if they're learning early scissor skills. It's great for little preschooler hands. Just have lots of wet towels ready so that you can clean up after them. That is a good idea. So that's one. You could tear the tissue paper as you well. Could. You could. Yeah, definitely. You could tear it. And then, yeah, just use lots of different colors. And it's a great way to recycle a lot of stuff that you have laying sure. around in the closets. Yeah. Uh, the second thing is don't overlook stickers. So in the crafts, stores right now you can find lots of Easter themed stickers so these are like little dimensional Very bunnies cute. right are those cute Very. but you know you don't have to get Easter specific stickers you can also get some out of whatever stash you've got laying around so these are ladybugs from a project I had that you know I just had some leftover and you always have leftover stickers right. you never use the whole exactly. sheet exactly mm -hmm. and my daughter loves ladybugs so I just let her go to town with that so it's a great way to use up some of your scrapbooking supplies and then these <laughs> Think outside the craft store, and these are yard sale tags. Yeah, left over from the garage sale. Yeah, how fun is that polka to do dots. like a whole little polka dot, uh, little Easter basket? Precious. And with one packet of these, you have enough to do at least a dozen eggs, all polka dot like that. So stickers. These are so simple. Why am I incapable of thinking of these things on my own? Yeah, you know, we're just so trained to do that <laughs> awful dye, and it gets everywhere on our fingers and our hands, and we're a mess by Easter. Okay, this is so exciting, though. Okay. Okay, this is. This oh. This is the cutest thing ever. These are tattoos. Okay, which where's our tight shot? Right here on one? Aren't those the cutest thing? So these are made to go on your finger, so you can be like a hipster and put your mustache on oh, your look, finger. And this one is the anchor man. They're mustache. totally perfect for the eggs. So, and I just did a simple little <gasps> Sharpie eyes, but how cute if you have like the, I didn't ha think of this last night, but if you have the sticky googly eyes, and then you could do a little yarn on top. Which I do. Here, let's get a good Aren't those so one. much fun? So cute. And, and they just go on like a regular tattoo. Why, what, what is it with the mustache right now? Kids are so into. I don't know. My daughter has a mustache on a monkey t-shirt. I can't get her to wear anything else at the moment. <laughs> but it's so trendy. That and then very cute. You could maybe even put some hair on it. Exactly. <gasps> okay. All right. I have an idea. So the Mod Podge hair. Not oh my gosh. That would be adorable. Okay. So I easy. Of like a little toupee. Proud of myself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> toupee. Um, and then just, just regular tattoos too. Again, they don't have to be Easter specific. Just get whatever your kids have. Okay. But they like you can get all this stuff at the craft store. Okay. So moving on to this is tape. Okay, this is washi tape, and it used to be you can only find it at like Japanese paper stores or washi fancy. Tape? It's called washi tape. Now they carry it at the scrapbooking section, so you can get all kinds of funky patterns and just let the kids, you know, they're not going to be perfect, but they're really fun, and it's a really easy, mess-free way. And this, and this is another thing that kids love right yeah, now. Yeah, right. Like anytime you let them play with tape. They're so excited. They are. Because that's such a grown-up thing to be it, able to play with tape. It is. Girls yeah. especially are into tape right now. Yeah. Okay, we'll have to try this one as well. Okay, so this last one I'm going to let you, we're going we're gonna to do this one. This is glitter. Okay, so now okay. I know glitter is like kind of messy, right? It's like um, the herpes of craft supplies. Oh, God, did you just say that? <laughs> Am I allowed to say that on TV? Can you it's say herpes on TV? It's a like herpes of craft supplies. <laughs> it's a medical term. Okay, so we <laughs> <laughs> Some pink glitter. You guys just never okay. know what you're going to get we're with me. Quick, I'm sorry. We're, 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 um, <laughs> we're short on time. So you would just put your double stick tape on there. Project up. <laughs> you would just put your double stick tape on there or your double stick um, round dots and you just roll oh, it in your glitter. Perfect. Dust it off. And then you get these little guys right here. <laughs> Super easy. <laughs> awesome. Jill, thank you. She's going to join us again later to tackle the challenge of what to put inside the Easter eggs. She has some new ideas when it comes to this tradition.